So let me understand this. As a UPS representative, you are not in America, and as a U.S. citizen, I demand to speak to a U.S.-based UPS agent, and you won't transfer me? Is that what you're saying? Sir, I uh, can just go ahead and connect you over back to the line, but, I mean, that is not guaranteed that you're going to get a, a U.S. representative. So what you're saying, uh, I mean, what, you're, what you're telling me is, UPS, which is an American company, will not allow a U.S. citizen to talk to a U.S. citizen employee. Is that what you're saying? No, sir. I don't see that. Okay. Can I, I speak to an American agent, please? Sir, we have actually to um, have a wash before, sir. If I connect to you uh, to speak, I don't have a way to connect you over right now to speak with a manager, uh, with an American um American um, customer service agent. Oh my God, this is a nightmare. I only want to speak to an American agent that works for UPS. I do not want to speak to someone that does not belong in America. I really do apologize for that inconvenience, sir. I really am. I'm more than welcome to helping you with any situation that you have in. But if I connect you over back to another line, most likely, you probably will get uh, somebody with our uh, research that we have in here, any other call center, sir. Okay. Thank you very much for your help. I really do apologize.